the expansion project of the Suez Canal Southern Section. The Suez Canal Authority aims to carry out the expansion project with a total length of 40 kilometers in two phases. The first phase of the project includes doubling the waterway in the small bitter lakes with a total length of 10 kilometers. The main objective of doubling the waterway in this area is to increase the navigation safety standards in addition to increasing the accommodation capacity in this section of the Suez Canal by six additional vessels. The bridging works in this part of the project are initially estimated at about 45 million cubic meters. The Suez Canal Authority aims to accomplish the waterway doubling by digging a parallel navigational lane to the west of the existing lane. The width of the new lane will be 292 meters at the surface and 127 meters at the bottom. The second phase of the project includes widening and deepening the canal with a total length of 30 kilometers. Through widening the canal 40 meters to the east and increasing the draft up to 27 meters. By concluding this part of the project, the width of the canal at this area will be 332 meters at the surface, while the width at the bottom will be 167 meters. Increasing the area of the water section in the southern part of the Suez Canal will reduce the speed of the sea currents by up to 20%. It will also reduce the sharpness of the curves located in the southern section which will contribute positively in facilitating the maneuvering process and the safe passage of all the transiting vessels. We have performed the maneuvering simulation in the southern section of the canal before and after the completion of the expansion project. This maneuver was performed on the dimensions of Ever Given, which is 400 meters long, with a beam of 58.5 meters and a draft of 15.7 meters. By calculating the blockage ratio after implementing the expansion project, the ratio will increase from 5.2 to 6.7. which means that the margin of navigational safety in the Suez Canal will increase by 28% and that will speed up the vessel's responsiveness to the rudder movement as well as increasing the vessel's ability to maneuver and cross the canal safely. The project works are divided into dry excavation of about 3 million cubic meters and dredging works of about 42 million cubic meters. The total execution period of the expansion project is 24 months. The Suez Canal Authority will carry out the expansion project with its own fleet of bridges in addition to the participation of one of its affiliated companies named Al-Tahadi.